everybody and welcome back to another edition of the Flop Doodle Chloe Bean Spark Team. Today's video is going to be teaching your dog how to go around an object. Chloe and I are going to show you what that trick looks like when it's done and then we'll teach you how to train your dog to do it. Alright Chloe, are you ready? Around! Around! Oh. Yes! Good girl! Wait. And around! Around! <coughs> Very good. Okay, so to teach the trick going around an object, you're gonna use a process called luring. So make sure you have plenty of nice, small, soft treats for your dog. You're gonna also wanna have a variety of items. So here I have a piece of PVC pipe and I wrapped it in duct tape. I also have a cone that I got at a dollar store. I have a mini baton she can go around and this is actually a yoga uh, roller, and you can use this as an item to go around, and we also use it as a barrel roll. All right, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is have your dog in a, um, in a position close to the item. We're gonna simply lure the dog with our treat. As soon as the dog makes it completely around the item, you're gonna tell the dog yes and give them the treat. All right, so we're gonna do this. Pull it around. Yes, good. Try that again. Around. Yes. Good. And you can use different items from the start to get your dog to go around. Really. Sometimes a little bit of a shorter item might work better so you don't have to switch hands going around. All right, Chloe, around. Around. Yes, very good. So you might treat on the second or third time around, not always after one revolution, but on the first day, the the thing you're gonna wanna do uh, is simply lure your dog around the item. Each time they do a successful rotation, go ahead and give them a yes or a click and give them their treat. After a while, you can start phasing the treat out by having a treat ready, but simply luring the dog around, yes, and then giving them their treat. Good girl. After a while, you'll phase the treat out completely. And remember, this can take a couple days or even a couple weeks, depending on your dog. And you're just gonna use a simple hand motion. Around, yes, around, yes. After a while, your hand motion will actually gradually get smaller, and you should be able to just send your dog around. Around, around. Very good, Chloe. Now you wanna wanna remember to do both around one way, and then around around the other way. Sorry, Chloe. It's a little tight up here on our stand. So that your dog doesn't get too used to doing one way over another. And then don't be afraid to use different items. All right, Chloe. Around. Around. Chloe. Good. Around. Yes. Around. Around. Very good. And the steps for this uh, process are going to be to lure your dog using um, a variety of objects and in a variety of directions. Once you've gotten that down pretty well, you can phase out the lure and just use your hand and then eventually reduce the hand motion to just a simple flick of your wrist to get the dog to go around an item. Have a great day, everybody.